What's up, YouTube? So I'm about to kick off a new video series because it's raining. Today's Sunday, the 28th of May. Um, waiting on some wire to come in so I can wire up my trans brake and boost controller and all that with my new Turbo 400. But I've got everything pretty much ready for the car to start and filled up with fluid and check everything out. Just waiting on some wiring. And uh, while I had a break, I figured I'd come over here and go back to my VHS collection with my VCR and convert a lot of stuff to digital. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm actually gonna start out and start showing you my 86 Z28 that I had back in the day. And um, I'll preface this by saying, I don't have a ton of videos about the car when I was working on it. I just, you know, using a camcorder back then wasn't as convenient as using your phone is now. But uh, long story short, this is a 86 Z28 Camaro that I bought, used when I was in college. <clears throat> and it had a 305 and a 700 R4 transmission. And um, I took it to the track at Benson. And one of the first cars I had, I started trying to learn how to race with. And um, I was like, I don't know, 19 or so at the time, 19, 20. And I uh, went to Benson, I uh, was able to make some like nine second passes in the eighth, which is very slow, but I was having transmission trouble where it was slipping and it wouldn't shift out of gear. And uh, that was keeping me from having any good ET. Uh, the 305 expired. I bought a 1970 Impala uh, used that I found in the classifieds. It had a 350 engine, four bolt main, all the good stuff in it. And uh, I took that engine, I actually had it built by a shop in Andrew, it used to be Dupes CarQuest. Uh, Tim Harmon used to work there. And I bought all the parts, he put them together for me. I put a set of dart heads on it, a solid roller cam in it. Uh, he went through the engine itself. I think we changed some pistons, rings, and stuff like that. It's been so long, I don't remember, but it was like, I don't know, 10 to 11 to one compression. And um, the car ended up running really well. I had to put a turbo 400 in it, which is, you know, not my first rodeo for 400, clearly now with this car. But trans brake, a set of uh, 456 gears, I believe I had in the car back then, and about a 3800 stall converter. And the best that ever ran on motor was 720s. And um, pretty phenomenal. It took me a while to figure it out. I was having some fueling issues and stuff and running a carburetor back then. But it was like a mid seven second car in the eighth mile, pretty much anywhere I went. And then went to Piedmont one weekend and ended up running the 720s. So uh, pretty happy with how that car ran. I was trying to spray it, but I kept having trouble with the nitrous system on that car. I never could get it sprayed and get into sixes with that car, but it did go 720s on motor. Some of the video you're gonna see is just me hanging out with the guys back in the day. We used to go to the car wash in Fuquay. That's where we kind of had an impromptu uh, car show would go on every Saturday from Mustangs, Camaros, all kind of cool stuff. And um, so I'm gonna show you some of this video. Hope you enjoy it. It's my 1986 Z28 Camaro, way before I ever had a Mustang. So some of you guys only know me by the Mustangs that I've got. And um, I actually started out in a Chevrolet Camaro. So hope you enjoy.
fucking race car. <laughs> Oh, here it is. <laughs> right, open that hood. I want to get that motor. Ryan told to himself. Duncan fast. <laughs> I know that's right. There it is. Uh, I can't see through this camera. My man's over there somewhere. <laughs> so what? Hey, get those that's the first thing to beat me. Yeah. Damn, that's it. That's the one that beat me. Hey, this one no beat Thank you. 